this is Artifacts of Mars. Uh, we have a situation in Boston. The high school cheerleader captain has been suspended from cheerleading for the rest of the season because she said... She put out a tweet there. The students were asked to watch the presidential debate for homework and then tweet out the uh, results. Unfortunately, she said the wrong thing. She didn't say something that was approved by the government. And when students complained, they uh, suspended her. Here's the tweet. Here's what it says. When only 10% of Revere votes for mayor because the uh, other 90% isn't legal, Godino said in the tweet. Kelly Gadino is her uh, name, and her high school is Revere High School. She said it was a response to a tweet from her teacher about low voter turnout in November's mayoral race. Kelly said she meant the tweet as a political comment, not a racist comment. Well, no fooling. But after other students complained, the school stepped in. Writing to the rescue, Revere Superintendent Diane Kelly says the district believes in free speech. Liar, liar, pants on fire. That is bullshit. But cannot support what she calls insensitive language. Screw you. If you're going to stand up and say something that other people find offensive, then you need to be need to prepare to deal with the ramifications of that. That is incredible bullshit. Kelly said, you extend the middle finger to him. Kelly's mother says, oh, and by the way, uh, dang, Kelly, I extend my middle finger to you. you got Kelly's mother said her daughter, who is a high school School's head cheerleaders now banned from cheering for the rest of the season doesn't think punishment fits crime. What crime? Oh, well, the crime is disagreeing with others. That's why I'm disagreeing what she's told to do. Um, Kaylee's mother told us the school decided to discipline her daughter because the intense backlash, and because of this controversy, the school is now creating a group of teachers and students to come up with a curriculum about diversity and acceptance. In other words, no political disagreement allowed. That's what this boils down to. So this school, because of a bunch of whining, sniveling brats, is going to completely eliminate all free speech. You have to agree with what they say, or you can't say anything. That's what this amounts to. That really sucks. This is, you know, let all the let the students who complain complain. I'd say. All right, you uh, huh. quit your bitching and you're going to get a licking. That's what I would say. Quit your bitching and you're going to get a licking. Sounds good to me. When only 10% of Revere votes for mayor because other 90% is legal. It's probably right, too. I am so going to bust on these sons of bitches. I am going to tweet them. And of course they're getting uh, an extremely negative video. And I'm going to address um, Revere Superintendent Diane Kelly right now. You, madam, are not fit to be in education, and I wish you would leave. If it were up to me, you would lose all qualifications immediately because you clearly don't understand the First Amendment. You, madam, are a tyrant 
and you are anti-American, I stand by that, those words. You are an anti-American tyrant. Your school district is run by anti-American tyrants. You hate freedom. You hate the First Amendment. You hate everything about there is, there is about this country. You are not an American in my book, madam. I'm not taking that back. You are an utter, total disgrace. Please leave. Well, that's about it. I got some uh, tweets of my own to do, and... I'm going to attempt to uh, contact this individual and tell her what I think of her. And Diane Kelly. Total, utter disgrace to this country. I'm not taking it back. This is Artifacts of Mars. Thanks for watching.